When you think of badminton powerhouses, you think of China, Denmark, Japan, Indonesia, Malaysia. You don't necessarily think of, well, Guatemala. But this is the home of four-time Olympian Kevin Corden. And this is a story about that fourth Olympics. When I went to the Olympics, I just, I thought, okay, I'm here again. Uh, God gave me the opportunity to play again uh, in the Olympic Games. Uh, so I had a uh, one year to, to have a good preparation. And then I, uh, I thought, okay, let's, let's have fun. Uh -huh, this is my last chance. I will play like a child. And I did it since the first point and then until the last point. <laughs> to be honest, I, I was just thinking uh, point by point. point. I was not thinking, okay, I, have, I had a chance to win one set, I had a chance to win the match. Uh, no, no, I was just having fun. I was, ju was just playing, I was just listening, listening to my coach, and I was playing point by point, point by point. And then when I, when I beat uh, the, the Dutch guy, I was, we, with my coach, we were, we were just happy. Uh, it was a really, really good feeling to win that match. It was really hard. It was, uh, in the beginning, it was nervous. Since the first point, the last point, I was just thinking like this. I was not thinking, okay, I won this guy and I won the number eight in the world. I, no, no. And then when I had the chance to, to, to be in the quarterfinals and play the guy from, from Korea, yeah. okay, two sets, and <laughs> it was just really nice. After, after the, when I beat this, uh, the Korean guy, I just started to cry because, uh, and then I realized, okay, I am in semi-finals, so that's why I was crying like a, like a kid, you see, amazing. In the beginning I knew that he was, he was going to be one of the, the favorites to win the, the, the gold medal. And I didn't think about, uh, okay, I'm in semi-finals, no, I was just thinking, okay, uh, let's play, let's play normal, uh, do your best, don't think if, if, if you are going to get tired soon or not, or if you, you, you want to lose easy or no. And I had a chance in the first set, to, at least to win the, the, the first set. And well, well and then he, he was better than me, of course, stronger than me. And in the beginning, it was, it was really, really sad because I had a chance not to win, to beat him, to get a medal. And it was really sad. And I just, uh, and I thought, okay, four semi final. It's okay. I'm very really happy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when, when you are an athlete, you, you have two dreams. First, to qualify, uh, qualify for the Olympics, and the second, to get a medal. And I'm happy, not because I, I lost the medal. I'm happy that I had two chances to, to get a medal. So it's all about the small countries like Guatemala can, uh, uh, can have like a really big dream. So that's why after Olympics, all this, this about badminton, about uh, sports, about Olympics was like that in, in Guatemala. So that was the Kevin Corden story. We hope you enjoyed it. And of course, happy Olympic Day. <laughs>